She was a true warrior and had the greatest fighting spirit and just her energy was like none other that I've ever experienced in my life. She made us all very proud. Margaret Benoit stands in front of this purple wall dedicated to her mother, Holly. We were really fortunate last year when we crossed the finish line that someone snapped a photo of our relay team going through hand in hand and um, we've turned it into this masterpiece. After 10 years of competing in the tri for a cure on a relay team with her mom and friend, this year Margaret is doing it alone. Kicking it into high gear and, and going to be out there on the course busting out all three. Holly battled cancer for a decade but lost her fight in April. Maine Cancer Foundation is honoring her with the wall of hope. Holly's husband says it's a fitting tribute. It is such a reflection of who Holly was as a as a pioneer in facing breast cancer as well as her involvement with the program. The wall has three sides, plenty of space for people to write messages on these magnets. Shine your own way and then I dedicate this to you. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's great, honey. Many jotting down their own inspiration ahead of race day and sticking it onto the purple wall. Purple was mom's favorite color and she was always very coordinated and matching. So when she wore purple, she did it well and she was usually head to toe in purple. And the quote along the bottom is one Holly wrote and her family found in her desk. Cancer can't, you know, stop me from reaching my goal or just crossing the finish line and doing the best she could every day. Words that will live on and inspire others on their own cancer journey. The Benoits celebrate the woman they love and miss. We have a couple of statements that we say in our family regularly, and one of those is family, 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 thank God for family. The other one is Holly, 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 thank God for Holly. And so for that, we are forever grateful.